Hey guys, this is Robbie Stahl, also known as the Fitness Doctor. Now, I'm not a licensed physician, although I'm an expert in helping people optimize their immune system through fitness, through nutrition, and also lifestyle habits. Now, here's the thing. The likelihood is you're going to get the coronavirus, I'm going to get the coronavirus. The way the numbers are going, half the country's population across the world are gonna get the coronavirus or more. Those are basically the way the numbers are going. Okay, and here's the thing. Let's make sure that all of our bodies are optimized in a way that our immune system's as strong as it can possibly be. Now the thing is, is just because you're fit or you're really pushing yourself with workouts doesn't mean that you're totally safe or your immune system's so very strong, because that's not the case. Most people actually kick the crap out of themselves trying to be so fit and like pushing themselves too far, which is actually an immune stressor because it's causing damage to the cells and the immune system's busy repairing the body and cells so it has more load on it to fight something like the coronavirus coming in. Of course, also if you're on fit. That's also very damaging to the immune system because the, your body is inflamed and the immune system is attacking basically your own cells trying to react against the excess body fat, the excess sugars, the excess inflammation, and all these things going on inside your body. Now I wanna give you five to 10 quick tips that are gonna help you tremendously to boost your immune system. One is, if you don't eat three to four hours before you go to bed, you're gonna boost your immune system. So intermittent fasting actually is very beneficial, especially prior to bedtime, because your body can have be done with digestion and begin repairing the immune system while you're sleeping. The other thing is, is during that time period that you're fasting, your whole entire immune system, some of the um, white blood cells begin to die off and it gives a signal for your body to, your satellite cells to reproduce new white blood cells, which these are those cells that are fighting infections, different diseases such as the coronavirus. So that's one huge thing. Another huge thing is fruits and vegetables. Quit buying freaking canned food okay there's no shortage in food right now that's not the issue let's buy healthy food for produce vegetables and fruits that are absolutely loaded with nutrients those are the things that are going to help boost your immune system the other thing is staying well hydrated the other thing is taking a probiotic the other thing is getting enough exercise that it's going to boost your immune system and quite simply if you're unfit that means that like about Whatever you can do in your maximal effort, you only need to do about half of that or down to like a third to get amazing benefits for boosting your immune system. You don't have to be an athlete to boost your immune system. There's so many different details that I can share with you and, and help care for yourself and your body in this time of crisis, health crisis. But here's the thing. I'd like to invite you to my Facebook group where I'm going to have some of the best doctors sharing advice on boosting your immune system, giving you amazing workouts at home, and giving you structure that can help uh, get you through this time period of your health, not only your health, but your family's health, and maybe those around you as well, friend, friends as well. So join the Facebook group, click on the button that you see here on the screen, and let's get going, making your life as amazing and your body as amazing as it can be during this time period.